first, the good news about Dakota. His last six home starts, he's 5-0, and ERA 1.41. And this St. Louis fan base hoping the Cardinals can stay alive. The one-two pitch, Albies out to short. DeYoung flips to second, jump throw to first, not in time. Nice play by DeYoung to Wong. And the first out of the ball game for the St. Louis Cardinals. And with one down, the Braves still have a runner at first base now for Freddie Freeman. Swinging a ground ball off the pitcher to this shortstop. Out at second and out at first to double play. Tankler, 31 year old Southpaw out of Tulsa, Oklahoma, made 19 starts for the Braves this year. Eight wins, eight losses, a 375 ERA. Swung on and missed strike three. And Keichel registers a strikeout, something he did not do in game one. This is going to be the part of the order that's going to be tough on Keichel. Goldschmidt's got four hits in the series and a home run, and Ozuna's red hot right behind him. Goldschmidt sends one deep to left. Way back. This one is going to fly out of here. Towering fly ball home run. And the Cardinals strike first. Paul Goldschmidt with his second home run of this division series. One nothing St. Louis, two down for Marcelo Zuna. Now Zuna, is that going to stay fair? And that one is gone. Back to back jacks for the St. Louis Cardinals. And it's two nothing St. Louis. Josh Donaldson to lead things off at the top of the second. Ground ball up the middle. The shortstop gets to it and throws. Got it. And uh, he came off the uh, bench, but. And the first base umpire called him out for leaving the bases. Not a cloud in the sky. McCann on the first pitch. First time all series. Remember what Lauren told you. And he pops it up, and that's going to be the inning. One down here in the second. Here's Tommy Edmond. Edmond rips one into the gap, left center field. That's going to get down. It goes to the wall. Edmond can run, and he will pull up the reins around second base. A swing at him as Keiko gets to Young for out number two. Three two. Got him looking strike three. Good sinker low and in on that inner third. Now the Braves putting up a threat here in this third inning. First and third with one away. Hit well out towards right center field. Tracking it Tommy Edmond and he runs it down in the gap. Tagging from third and scoring is Swanson. So the Braves register a run on the sacrifice fly by Ozzie Albies. Freeman bounced into a double play. There he goes. Freddie Freeman strikes out. The Braves got a run on two hits and left Acuna on base. Colton Wong struck out back in the first inning. One two he lunges and misses for strike three. Got him on the same pitch in the first inning. Popped up foul ground Freeman comes over he may have room right there in front of the dugout and he squeezes it and there is out number three. That's a one two three inning composed by Keiko. Braves have the tying run down at first base for Nick Marcakis. Marcakis hits a double play ball to DeYoung. Flip to Wong one on to first two. A double play. 2 0 pitch and there's a high fly ball. Medium left field. Ozuna looking up into the blue sky makes the catch. You do feel like though watching this game is that the Cardinals have to add on some runs here. The one two pitch. Swing and a fly ball hit to deep left field. This is a gunner. A home run that hit the billboards above the Braves bullpen. A two home run game for Ozuna and the Cardinals lead by two again. And the end of the line for Dallas Keiko. Three and a third today for Keiko. And the new pitcher, Ron, is Luke Jackson. Strike three. He thought it was ball four. And so did 45,000 here at Bush Stadium. 2 2 pitch. That got him. Swung on and missed. Big spot here for Atlanta. You got Duvall at the plate. Runner at third, one out. Two on. Ground ball to Carpenter, and it ricochets off of his chest and rolls free. Duvall is safe at first. A run scores. And it's three to two here at the top of the fifth. Albies loves to swing first pitch. Tying run at first. Pitch on the way. High fly ball to deep right field. This will send back Tommy Edmond at the wall. That one is gone. Ozzy Albies with a two run home run. And the Braves take a 4 3 lead as lightning strikes here on the top of the fifth. Cardinals have Ozuna at the plate with Goldschmidt at second as the tying run popped up. Foul ground. Here comes Freeman right at the railing of the Cardinal dugout. He's got it. That's a big out. The base is loaded, and John Brebia is on to pitch for St. Louis. The 1 2 pitch, and a swing at him as Brebia strikes him out. 
Now the bases are loaded again for the second consecutive inning. Here's the 0-2. Echeverria sends one deep in the left field. Ozuna is back, and he's got it. Oh, I thought he jumped him. It dies at the wall. He must have just missed it on the barrel. One out here in the eighth inning. Brian Snitker will call on Shane Green now. And Goldschmidt breaks his bat. That is going to fall. Base hit. Down into the corner it goes, and Goldschmidt on his way to second with a double. It's a one-out double for Paul Goldschmidt, and the Cardinals have the tying run at second. Cardinals with a chance here. Long ball puts him ahead. And Molina shoots one to right. Off the glove of Freeman. In the score is Goldschmidt, and this game is tied. Molina delivers for the Cardinals in the postseason again. All tied at four. Braves leave Shane Green out there looking to keep the Cardinals at bay, take it to extra innings. And he swings and rips one into center field, a base hit, wasting no time. Tommy Edmond with a single to start the ninth. Here's 1-1 one, one on the way, runner goes, pitch is swung onto the fly ball to right field, Marquecas is there, he squeezes it, he throws to first base, here comes Tommy Edmond, and it trickles off the glove of Freeman, rolls to the Cardinals dugout, down to second goes Edmond. He went to second, back to first, and now back down to second. Matt Wieters is the pinch hitter, switch hitting catcher. Green deals, and a swing, and a fly ball to right. Marcake is coming in. Edmund will tag, and he'll stop. And here it is. Swung on and missed, strike three. Shane Green fired up, yelling at himself as he walks off the field. Julio Tehran has not pitched in 11 days. Yadier Molina is one for four. Now the pitch. Molina swings and it's a high fly ball. Left field, this should win it. The catch is made by Duvall. Tagging at third, Wong comes down the line. The throw home, we're going to game five. Wong scores on the game winning sacrifice fly by Yadier Molina and in St. Louis for game four of the NLDS, it's a Redbird winner.